My name is Denise Hoban and I'm the owner of Skip Jeff Jewelry and my shop is on Etsy. And I'm here today to, I wanna to show you a quick uh, two part video. They're each gonna be about three to five minutes long on how to create a stamp and how to turn that stamp. It actually comes from a, a laser printer design of your choice. You make it into a stamp. Oops. And then you make your stamp into a pretty piece of silver jewelry. Anyways, I'm gonna show you the steps. They're not that hard, so keep watching. Okay, so I've got my design that I printed out with a graphic program um, off my computer and I printed it off on my laser toner cartridge. And what I'm gonna do is everywhere that you see black on this stamp, I'm gonna take my Sharpie and I'm gonna fill it in a little bit darker just because the UV lamp that I'm going to use to harden the um, poly, photo poly uh, gel, um, I don't want any of it being able to seep through f with light. First, I printed my design on my laser toner printer onto transparency film. I touched up the black area with permanent black marker to make it opaque or non-translucent. Then place your design face up on a piece of glass. I used regular glass off of picture frames and just taped the edges with black electrician tape. Then put your gasket form on top of your design. Then fill the form or your gasket with the photopolymer resin. Try to avoid bubbles as you're inputting your resin. If you do get bubbles, try to get rid of them with a pin or move them around. Place another piece of glass on top of the resin filled gasket. Then set the timer for 15 seconds. The first pass will be to harden the top of the stamp or the solid piece of the stamp. Start the UV lamp. Flip the package over and set the timer for 25 seconds. Again, start the UV lamp. Take the resin out of the form mold. It will be goopy, but you should be able to see your design through the goop. Using a sponge, try to get the excess goop off of the stamp. Have a paper towel handy. It gets pretty sticky. Put the stamp in the water and cover the UV lamp for about a minute. In the background, I'm preparing the stamp holder. I filled my mold with UV resin, which I will also harden under the lamp. Trim off the excess edges um, around your stamp. Now I am hardening the mold filled with the UV resin. This piece will actually hold the stamp. I'm also giving the stamp an extra shot just to harden it a little bit more. I often do this. I just throw the extra pieces in if I'm hardening something else. Now I'm filling a square mold that will be used as a resin stamp holder's handle. I 
I'm also using the UV resin to glue the handle to the stamp holder. I usually heat the UV resin pieces from one to two, sometimes even three minutes. Now I'm using the UV resin to glue the photopolymer resin stamp inside of my stamp holder. Awesome. A is for awesome. I like it a lot. Okay.